Wow, lighting, that's better. Hi everybody, I'm back and I'm going to be doing a quick, another quick review on, I guess you'd call it scents, because I have a bunch of different, other than Bath and Body Works. So, we stopped at Target, we went to a bunch of different places, we had to run a bunch of errands, stuff for the new house, towels, you know, things like that. And then I decided I had the shower curtain and everything picked out. I thought, you know what, I'm going to wait until we get there and get everything moved. And then I'll go out and get it. It's just too early. It's more stuff to move. And it'll still be there, hopefully. Except I'm going to make sure I have the curtains because it's going to be really bright. Anyway, so before I ramble on, let me uh, review the Bath and Body Works first. And then I will do the rest. So... We got these cute covers last year for Halloween. Um, for a new house, for a new house, um, I probably won't use them. Closer to Halloween, I might. I'm not sure how they snap on. I think they're from for village candles. Ex actually, they are. So these won't work. They're for or they're for the village plug-ins. That's what they're for. You can see the back how they snap on. And all of those are in the kitchen, so I can't show you one. I brought a, a Glade. Oops, a Glade plug-in. And a actually, I wanted to give you guys a real quick tip of the day. These get old after six months. You need to replace the plug-in holders. They don't throw the scent as well when you buy the plug-in oils. So you have to replace these every six months. If you notice, um, after a while, if you have one for quite a while, it will quit smelling. That's because it's old and you need to get a new one. Now, I used to have a bunch of fan ones that had fans in them. I used to have to dust it with a, you know, a toothbrush and take the vacuum and suck the dust out. But they don't sell the fan, fan glade scent things anymore, which is kind of frustrating. But anyway, I'm sure my husband is happy because our house was just reeking of not bad scents, good ones, just too much. Anyway, so what I got from Bath and Body Works was, of course, leaves, and these were $9. I had coupons. They're not in the normal packaging, but I don't care. As long as they're, as they're leaves, I can put them in a different, in a, I can put a sleeve around them, whatever. So they, I can smell it through the paper. They were in the car. It was really hot. Now this one... Anthony loves lemons, so we'll put this, I don't know, in his bathroom or whatever. It's called Coastal Sun. It's like the end of a sum, summer launch. It smells like pure lemon, so it's a three wicker. Um, and it says, catch some beautiful rays with this blend of vibrant orange, zesty, grapefruit, and bright beach days. To me, it smells like pure lemon, so there's that one. He loves lemon, loves it. He's from California, and you can pick them off trees. I would love to have bowls of lemon sitting all over my house, but they cost like 50 cents here. It's crazy, and they're about this big. I just think they're beautiful. You can buy the plastic ones, but anyway. Okay, so then we move to the good ones. I will Instagram these with the clothing. This is one of the leaves I've never seen packaged this way. Um, I don't know if it's White Barn or if it's um, Bath and Body Works. It, it says Bath and Body Works. It's leaves scented. Beautiful autumn leaves full of light and color are captured in a fragrance made in a fragrance made by glittering golden nectar, red apple, and spiced berries. So this one is leaves. And it looks like it's um, layered fragrance, but it's all the same colored wax. But it's in a different shade. Um, my other candles are down in the garage, which I need to go get right after I'm done doing this video. It is really hot, and I'm afraid they're going to melt. Oh, I want to light this so bad. It's, it smells fabulous. This was, this was $9. Yeah, crazy. None of their other candles are on sale. And I had a 20% off coupon. She let me use that on top of it. So it was about $7. So yeah, there's the little label. I can tear it right off and put a, I think I'll probably put a sleeve over it. So there's one. I, first thing I said when I walk in, I always say, are they two for 22? She's like, no, but I have 
this, and I'm like, okay, as long as she knows I love leaves. Anthony picked this up. This is Marshmallow Pumpkin Latte. Fabulous. They have this in body scents. I didn't go for any body scents, but I will go back. They had buy three, get three free, which is a fabulous deal. I mean, it's amazing. This is Creamy Pumpkin Toasted Marshmallows and Praline. Um, and the scent is our gentle foaming hand soap that transforms into a rich creamy lather. Gently wash away dirt and germs while soothing aloe leaves, uh, nourishing vitamin E, hands feeling soft and smooth. And it doesn't have the scent description on the back. So it's marshmallow pumpkin latte. It smells fabulous. Now, he likes the foam type. I like the scrubby type, the thicker cream type, but they both are great. So we just grab one for here until we move. The rest of them are downstairs because I don't feel like filling the whole house with candles if we're going to move. So everything's packed and blah, blah, blah. So there's that one. And then, oh, she threw in another, another uh, coupon. Good. So this one is another leaf candle. It was I have to grab the receipt. Nine dollars, and then twenty percent off that. So this is a Bath and Body Works. I've never seen this brand before. It's crazy. It has this lid. Um, it's fabulous. Oh my gosh. This one just burned out. I'm gonna throw it out. This pump pineapple mango. It's a summer one, and the wax looks gross. I'm not gonna tap it out and save the jar. I just have too many. I'm at the point where I'm just purging right now, throwing things out, and then I'm, I go back looking, look, looking for them. I'm like, I need that. And it's gone. So I got two leaves candles. They were, let me grab the receipt. So they were nine sixty. Uh, they were ten fifty nine. Normally twenty two fifty, and then they went to ten fifty, then to nine sixty. Yeah, I thought she said they were seven. Anyway, I and then there was a two twenty five discount off of each two forty off each candle, so they were nine six sixty. That's crazy. Yeah, so these leaves candles were six dollars. That's that's insane. So that's what I got from Bath and Body Works. Didn't feel like shopping. We were starving. We went to our favorite place afterwards. I didn't Instagram it. So, while we're doing scents, I will wrap that up. It's too loud and rattly. Um, while we were at Macy's, I know I'm throwing Macy's back in. I was going to do a couple of frag reviews. Let me do these first. I picked these up at Target. They are fabulous. Now, I know these are just drugstore or grocery store, but these smell so good. And they're a new launch. I've never seen them before. Um, they're Glade. I have these all over my house. I buy like eight at a time. And these are called Pit Stop. Pumpkin Pit Stop. They smell fabulous. They're Glade, of course. They were at Target. I think there's two in this one. And they were like two twenty five, Crazy. So I grabbed a bunch of these for a new house. Um, after a while, the drywall and the carpet starts nauseating me. The paint cut, the paint smells, you know, all the new stuff. I mean, it's a good smell, but it helps to have this cut and cover it up. So I grabbed these for the new house. I thought I would vlog them real quick. They had an apple one. I can't remember. I think it was called Apple Toss. It smelled great, too, if you like apples. For fall. Um, of course, we are all pumpkins, so there's those. And that is everything for this review. Oh, and then I have a couple frag reviews. I have a ginormous one I will do later. Um, huge. This entire bag is full of new launch. Yeah, it's it's like pulling teeth to get a sample. I'm not kidding you. I fell, recently fell in love with Terry Mugglers, uh, one of her scents. I, I used to hate them. I used to absolutely hate her scents. But one of them I fell in love with. It's called Alien. 
sanitary muggler um, and it's where you can go and get your your bottle refilled but it's actually more expensive I think to have it refilled than to just go buy a new bottle if that makes any sense I don't know but it, to me I would think it would be cheaper to have your old bottle refilled but anyway so yeah alien by Terry Muggler smells fabulous it's still on my hand. I sprayed it hours ago. It smells very spicy, uh, cinnamon. I would say it's got bergamot, um, what's that, vetiver. And then it dries down to vanilla, and it smells very, very spicy. And then the, there's a new Jimmy Choo. It's called Illicit. Here's a card. It's a sample. This is the new sample. I was like, are you kidding me? Yeah. There's the bottle. Um, it's a girl holding it. Um, I think this was 110, but this is the sample. They don't even have the spray. I was like, are you kidding? You pull this back. It smells very close to Jimmy Choo 1. Um, all the Jimmy Choo smell have that same one or two notes that, that make it smell the same as all the Jimmy's. They just kind of steer off a little bit. The limited edition green and pink, I think, are going away for summer. Um, and go, they're going back to Jimmy Choo Flash, Jimmy Choo Regular, and then they just brought this one out. So maybe he'll get me this one for Christmas. J Christmas. Jimmy Choo Illicit is fabulous. I don't have the notes. Didn't look it up. But it smells very close to the first one. So those are the two I'm going to do for right now. So I have tons more. This bag is sealed. It's got a bazillion frags in it. These are Paris Hilton's. Hers I'm not sure on. I haven't smelled them. This is from Perfume Mania. It is sealed like a seal a meal. Three samples inside. So this one is from Macy's. Versace. These are all the high end. Uh, Greg. So I will go over these later, men's and women's. I'll do them in separate videos. It's a little, little too confusing to do them together. So I hope you guys enjoy this. I will get this uploaded and I will see you in a while. I'm going to get some stuff thrown in some boxes and then I have a couple huge bath hauls if you guys want to see them. Ginormous. It's crazy. I don't know where I'm going to put all this stuff. Well, my blogging room. And then I'll just have to go in in the morning and grab whatever I'm going to use and throw in the jetted tub. I cannot wait. Anyway, so the house, if you guys are wondering on an update on the house, it is done. There's a few things they need to fix. The lawn went in, supposedly went in today. It was supposed to go in yesterday. They painted yesterday again um, for the third time. Um, all the cabinets are done. Everything's done. They put the carpet in the day before yesterday. I think it was what? Tuesday, day after Labor Day. Um, so the carpet's in. It looks beautiful. All they need is to add a fan over the fireplace that they forgot or didn't get input in yet. And all the blinds. I ordered those. Those are, uh, the wood, the faux two inch wood. And they're in like, I think they're called coconut. It's like a cream white matches the paint perfectly so I will I'm of course I'm out, I'm gonna put curtains over them so and then just pull them back to the sides and then I pull the blinds up every day they say blinds wood blinds last about eight years if you pull them up every day that's about exactly right because at my other house I think it was a day it's old we pulled uh, one of the blinds up and it broke and it was exactly eight years but anyway, I will let you guys go. I just thought you might want an update. So yeah, we will be moving probably in about 10 days. So got to get going. Going to get this packed up. I'm going to do a review on, I have huge hat boxes stuff full of Lush and Feeling Smitten, Fortune Cookie Soaps, um, other companies. And I have soap companies. It's crazy. So if you guys want to see all this stuff, let me know. Otherwise, I won't do it but I just right sitting right here I have bath bath salts in tank from FCS and a soap that's unopened this one is also the boy who never grew up Peter Pan I assume never seen it before crazy you can see the little feather in his hat 
smells fabulous. So yeah, this is these are Tinkerbell bath salts. Haven't used these yet. One oh they smell fabulous. One thing you don't want to do in a jetted tub is add a lot of bubble bars. You will have bubbles to the ceiling. You have to cut them. I don't know what I'm going to do with all of my cupcakes. Anyway, I will get this uploaded. I will see you guys in a few minutes if I do another video. I probably will. Three's, three's the limit. Check the mail. My, my boxy charm isn't here yet, and I'm still waiting on my Luxor in a couple other boxes. So I will see you later, and yeah, I will do another frag review in a while. Thanks for watching, and give me a thumbs up, sub, sub, sub. I will subscribe back. There's a lot of subs i got to get back to, so I will work on that, and I will see you all later. Have a great afternoon. Enjoy your Saturday. They go fast. And then if you guys need me to still um, whoops, help you with this DIY, the paper garland, I will help you do another video, like a part two. I know the first one I zoomed through. Here is a piece that's cut ready to be wired and then when I do that tree the autumn tree it's gonna be beautiful I'll pull it in it'll be will probably be out in the living room and I'll set the camera up it'll be easier that way and then um, I need to go get the leaves that's what I need to do so anyway hopefully I can do that soon maybe now I don't know I was hoping Anthony would stop and then we forgot I know he would have stopped but we forgot anyway I will see you all later give me a thumbs up have a good day, and uh, bye. Oh, if you're wondering what lip product I'm wearing, I am wearing Apocalypse from Urban Decay. I just sharpened it. It is just about gone. Where did it go? Yeah, got to get a new jar. It is really creamy. It's called Super Saturated, and that is how much is left. Yeah. So you have to use a special sharpener, and it's called Apocalypse, and I wear Venom with it, the liner Venom, and then I'm I'm just wearing this over it, this one. This is a lipstick, uh, Beauty for Real. I usually put a gloss over it, but this is what I'm wearing over it. Um, it's from the Mimi boxes, and it is called Always There. So. And it's got an LED light in it, which is dying down, but it's cute. Anyway, so I will see you all later. I know I get a lot of requests on what I was wearing on my lips, so I thought I would tell you real quick. Anyway, thanks for watching, and have a good day. Bye.